And hopefully uh, everyone makes it out of there safely. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Yeah. Especially not considering, you know, so many went into that, not thinking they would be there that long. While they're getting so much rain there, Dominus, we're struggling to get hardly any rain around here. Yeah, some of us got lucky to see some showers and storms yesterday, but they were very spotty. It didn't rain over my house, so, you know, I was one of the unlucky ones, yeah. Yeah, so we'll see if we can do it today, you know, but uh, it's a holiday, so we don't want rain, right? Well, you'll see over North Dallas, we have a few clouds, but also some sunshine and temperatures at 82 degrees. Your first alert weather headlines, the triple digit heat is back. See, it ain't so. But here we go again. Near record highs this week and a few showers and storms ahead in the forecast. Today, though, most areas will be dry, so you'll see the table all set and temperatures by noon, likely into the low to mid 90s, 100 degrees toward 4 and 92 by 8 o'clock this evening. Not a bad day for us, but the heat will be bad for us as we go through this week. Near record high temperatures starting Wednesday through at least Saturday. We've been here before, we could do it again. So let's brace ourselves for it. We talked about the rain last night. Check out some of the rainfall totals from yesterday. Waxahachie, you hit the jackpot more than an inch of rainfall, almost three quarters of an inch, and really more than that in Fort Worth and DFW Airport, a little less than, how about that, quarter of an inch of rain? It's been a while since some of us have seen rain. Unfortunately, some of our lakes not doing so well below full pool. If you're going to be on the lake for today, you need to be extra careful out there because things are not looking great. And unfortunately, we don't have a lot of significant rain in the forecast. Today, we have about a 10 to 20% chance. Mainly, it's going to be east of the Metroplex. You'll see on first alert radar, a little shower is just trying to sneak in a little closer, you know, to areas here in Collin County. You'll see also toward Paris and toward Cooper, Sulphur so Springs and Emory, down to the south there toward Coffin and Van Zandt counties. Not a lot of wet weather. On um, first of all, future cast for the next couple of hours, you'll notice the showers generally east of the Metroplex. I'll be watching the one in, in Collin County. But overall, a lot of this wet weather will start to push farther away from us. It won't be raining all day. In fact, a lot of us will be clear tonight and we'll have temperatures in the 70s. So you'll see that hourly forecast. Oh, yeah, not too well. It could be better. <laughs> not too bad. Last week was great and temperatures were in the 90s, low humidity values. As we look ahead, first alert seven day forecast, you'll see that the triple digits are not going anywhere anytime soon, at least. We have a little glimmer of hope by the weekend with a few showers and thunderstorms that could take the temperatures down to about 100 on Saturday and maybe 99 on Sunday. The menace will take it. all the rain we can get. Yeah, exactly.